So what I'm going to do now is just change the tables around. So it's going to remove product names and product category. Drag the year to the rows. Unclick revenues. Click on profitability and quantity. After we do that, we click on power pivot. Calculated fields, new calculated fields. And then we put in our formula. So, going to put a bracket. Sum of probability divided by sum of quantity. Click OK. You can change the calculated field name, so I just added a 6 to it. See, so created an extra column. So now I'm going to create my KPI, which is so I click on KPI, new KPI. Now I'm just going to play around with this. So, as you can see, it doesn't match to the new column that we, which we created in calculated field six. So I decided to just play around with it. Um, just drag it, the red down to 4.6 percent, negative seven. And just drag that down to let's say probably about two percent. Click OK. It won't work. So we click on absolute value and put zero point zero one. which is our target so I gonna move the red zone to the negative and try and adjust it just drag it a bit more to the right Then we click OK. It will show you the numbers. So what we'll do now, so we can see the the colors. We just click on status and status again, and you can see the color right there. And you can see the colors, which is good, which is neutral, and which is bad. You can also click on pivot charts. You can create a wide range of charts out of that. See the preview there. And thank you for watching.